1977, so let's go. so bad, but I can. We have Johnny in our heads just yet, so. Well, in my head, I should say. There's Rhodes' car. No. Porque ya tengo planes. Sí, mamá. Te vas a enterar mañana. Yo también te quiero, ma. Yeah, about time, Holmes. What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. <laughs> Whatever. Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! The afterlife. Known far and wide, that name. Oh, yeah? Some of the Nomad Clan's biggest jobs are scored right here. Don't surprise me. Ain't no better place than Night City to land a gig. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! This place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. With proper burials, we're still a thing. And who might you clowns be? Name's V. This is Jackie Wells. Oh. Is that supposed to sound familiar? It will soon. 
We're here to see Dex. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? All right, then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. Hey. Grab a seat. Here, get a sec. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest. Oh. What, boy? Maybe. Looks like we're up. There's Rogue. Hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all of Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. Yes, it does. What can I get you? I'm good, thanks. For real? I'm celebrating. Come on. So me. Chingada madre. Fine. Have it your way. A tequila old fashioned with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. One Johnny Silverhand coming up. Right on, chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. Ah, what a beautiful tradition. Guess dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, ginger beer. Oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. Ha <laughs> I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Deshaun, see you now. My job to know. Look around. How do you think mercs earn their reps? Through gossip rivaling that of schoolgirls, that's how. Dex a regular. You come here a lot. A sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. The Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. <laughs> Break a leg. Thanks. This way. Damn, Holmes. You're huge. <clears throat> Work out? Mm. Same here. No, in the ring. You do some kind of exotic shit? Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? Mm. Think you could take me? Drop me? In here. Still pinch it, tipo. That's right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies, as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Mr. V. Whole family in one place. Ha! Finally! First time in real space. And the flathead? Let's see this bad boy. All right, then. Set your butts down comfy. Thanks for your help back at the scav haunt. A few Reapers less in the city. Good thing. <laughs> city Hall should be fucking thanking us. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's all right with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? 
Well as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza inside from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm-hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target? Yorinobu Arasaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm-hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? Orchid chick? I don't know. Sent out mixed signals, so I got mixed feelings. One night, sipping champ paradise with Yorinobu. Next night, chatting it up with regulars at Lizzie's. Worlds don't match up. Struck me, too. You saying we putting two and two together and getting five? Some part of the equation's missing, then. Clearly. That's why y'all gotta fix her. Anyone try to fuck you? They first gotta fuck their way through Dex to Sean's 300-pound ass. Anything else? I think she just wanted to see what I was about. Wanted to see what she was about, huh? How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. Goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Transport's a Delamay. Remus Cap Company in all night city. Not a mall. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The no-tell motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Arasaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? How do we get in the penthouse? Yarnobu's got barely any muscle. Hardest part will be penthouse security. If we want to disable, we'll need to neutralize Kompeki's dweller, elite runner monitoring the hotel subnet 24-7. Only catch is there's no way to get in the dweller's den from the outside. Well, hold on. How you want us to get inside a room you can't get into? Trust me when I say whatever hit you think of, T-Buck solved it already. This is where the flathead comes in. You'll have to get him in the ventilation shaft, guide him to the dweller, and force the dweller to take a break. Flathead will stay there, jacked into the dweller. But thanks to that, I'll be able to roll out your red carpet into the penthouse. Anything else? Okay, feel brought up to speed. Perfect. I got a question. When do we get to the real reason we're all here? Cut for fresh talent's always the same and non-negotiable. 30%. Bro, 30? Every part in this drama carries its risks. That's the value of yours, as determined by me. Come on, Dex. Isn't that a little low? Hey, hold on, Holmes. Who got the flathead? Who pulled the intel from the brain dance? And we're going in a hotel full of soccer men to swipe some fucking toy from the boss's son. We are the job. 
Hmm. And who's providing transport? A top-tier net runner and a lead-proof plane and intel? You sure you want to go down this road? Jack's right, Dex. We ought to get more than 30. We deserve more. Fine. 35. And that's my final offer. I can live with that. It's my final offer, too. Hmm. Been a while since I got a run for my eddies. They're actually kind of fun. Last thing, kompeki has got a strict no-iron policy. Security gates, the works. So you dogs will leave your lead spitters in the ride. Take the flathead inside in its case. Got some deft suits, so you'll look the part, too. Oh, thanks, D. So, not to count chickens, but why don't we see our eddies? All depends how Miss Parker avails herself of her role. But a week, two tops, is my guess. And what do we do while we sit around, suck air? You sit tight, heads down, because old Uncle Arasaka be watching. Now, as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet, so don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. It's my cue to Delta Two. Gotta prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues, now's your chance. Plan. What's your take? <laughs> Enough, I hope, to put me in a luxury Cretan villa from which I'll never set foot in cyberspace again. Promise to send me a postcard? No offense, but I'm gonna burn any and all bridges. Need a clean break. You and Dex know each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, people say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius. <laughs> you and Dex both philosophizing. No wonder you get along. I'm good, no questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Something I gotta take care of first. Sin problemas. Meet you by the Delamain. Thank you, Jackie. What are you talking about, Guama? What do you mean? Anything? Not right now, Claire. My systems inform me that we await one other passenger. Yep, on his way, catching up. Delamain service. With Delamain, you leave your problems at the door. Son of a bitch. Better fucking believe I will. I see no reason why you should be using expletives. Oh, yeah? What about that time I wanted to hire you for my cousin's bachelor party, huh? Unfortunately, we do not take on such contracts. Three months I'd been saving up scratch. Eh, yeah, water under the bridge. Hit it, Del. Before we begin our journey, 
I must verify the identities of all customers. Please proceed to connect your personal links. Thank you. Excelsior package activated. Excelsior? Oh, this just keeps getting better. Excelsior. The Excelsior is a package tailored to our premium clientele. Top quality don't come free, you know. Now watch. Delamain, initiate combat mode. My apologies, but you do not appear to be in any sort of imminent danger. Huh. Oh well. Trust me. You'll mow down an army of Saka Ninjas if it comes down to it. Excelsior, what else is included? Comprehensive health coverage, including the handling and disposal of a client's remains should death occur on board. Damn. Shit got dark pretty quick. This combat mode even legal? Of course it is. The Second Amendment says so. While on board, you are entirely within your rights to bear and use me. Mm. Dex ain't skimping, is he? At least we got some clue where his 65%'s going, huh? Excelsior. This is how you want to cruise into the major leagues. Wouldn't get overly excited. Hmm? Haven't gotten there. Not yet. No, Jack. Kinda feels like you're losing that steel grip of yours. Huh. Seems to me like it's you who's got some kind of problem. We Need you to keep your head clear in the game. You've got a job to do. It's never, ever been clear in my whole fucking life. Let me explain something to you, V. My whole life I've spent in this shit around us. This fucking sandpaper. We'll be, uh, pulling up to the hotel soon. Listen, set up a direct encrypted line to guide you through Compeki. V, ring Jackie now, see if we're in sync. Can't be too careful. And? Hmm. Got static. Say something, bug. The greatest crimes issue from a desire for excess, and not from necessity. Say what now? Aristotle. Guess you read me then. Yeah, I read you. Not so much your Greek friend. Though it was kind of exciting. Could give it some thought. Try to understand. How about you, V? Read you loud and clear. Perfect. Okay. Tech checks out, looks like. Será mejor que sí. Stay in touch. Thank you for choosing the Delamain service, and best of luck. I shall await here for your return. It's finally happening. Almost forgot, no iron, huh? All right, Harry. Let's go. Hold on. Let me grab the flathead. We're out front, Bug. Member, reservations in your name, Ramon. You're there to meet Hajime Taki, military tech department rep. Papers are for the flathead. Welcome Don't to worry. Kubeki Plaza. Got this. Welcome to Kompeki Plaza. Please come through single file. You got it, home. Uh, <clears throat> sir. <laughs> <clears throat> Hold on. Got something. Care to explain why you're bringing military equipment onto the premises into Compeki Plaza? We're arms dealers. Excuse me? 
Ah, you are here to see Taki-san. Am I right? Please, accept my apologies for the confusion. <laughs> this should only take a moment, sir. Go ahead. Yokoso. Greetings and welcome to Konpeki Plaza. We'd like to check in. Of course. Just a moment, please. The name on the reservation is? Victorino. Double room, two adults, one night, correct? That's the one. Perfect. I'll go ahead and notify Takisan of the arrival. Shit, no good. Not part of the plan. Talk her up, V. Stall. That won't be necessary. We'll go freshen up first, notify him ourselves. But Takisan is expecting you, no? Senorita, do you know how long we've been traveling? 18 hours from New Barcelona. With a delay on Medici because some cyber cycle blew himself into bits inside the terminal. Oh, a nightmare. Of course, I understand. You'll be in the Lapis Lazuli Suite on level 42. Oh, one more little formality. Please validate your SID chip. Honor's all yours, Harry. Everything seems to be in order. We wish you a pleasant stay. Thank you. Better get going. Barcelona, really? It's called improvising. You should try it. What do you think, Harry? Hmm? Quaint, cozy. Not like the hotel we had in Zurich for that convention. Don't need that, Jack. Enough. What? You're taking this seriously. Welcome to Compeki Plaza. We don't do reservations weekdays, so feel free to grab any available table. Or a couple of stools at the bar if you prefer. Could bring Misty here one day when we uh, close this deal. We will, I'm sure. Now let's go check out our digs. saying this, but not bad at all. Yeah, I look good in everything. Well, here we are. Lapis. We're in our room. Pretty snazzy. Too bad we ain't staying the night. Nice choice, Buck. Didn't pick it for snazz. Offers quickest access to the dweller and servers. Si, si, me acuerdo. Now you fire up the flathead and find the shaft entrance. Sounds simple enough. Simplicity is sometimes toughest to master. Aurelius? Aristotle? Who's it this time? Yours truly. That one's mine. Where's the shaft? Boot up your scanner. Look around. Flathead prep to go? Almost there, Carnal. Got a winner. Good. Jackie, how's the flathead looking? Oh, sick. Systems are operational. Charge it a hundred. Mierda. Little conk stock. Just 
gonna stand there and look at it? Gonna have to switch to manual control. V, take the control shard from Jackie. Gonna link your Kiroshis to surveillance so you can guide the bot. Why me? Why do I gotta slot it in? Unlike someone, I haven't run on my tab with Vic. Got last gen firmware. No flow. Just do it, bro. There. Ain't got all day. Surveillance cover the whole hotel. Mm-hmm. Even the bedrooms and the suites. Guests don't care? You'd be surprised what people are willing to give up to feel secure. Lucky for us, Yurinobu is an exception. Penthouse is dark, no hotel security. Here. Here goes. Patching you through to in-cam view. Might get a little disoriented, but don't freak. Okay, got a clear view. You can't just go locking people out of their homes. Get them to the next vent. Places of work. Arasaka will cover the cost of any and all penalties assessed. This isn't about the money. It's election season. How do you think this will make me look? People start saying I've lost control of Watson. District I'm from. A week. That's all we can promise you. We will try. And that is all I can promise you. Okay, Flathead's in. Patching you into next cam now. What makes you think it was for you? He addressed it to the kind housekeeper who finds him. Note inside said, sorry for the mess. There was blood everywhere. But at least he left a tip. Am I the only one that just gets puke and used condoms? Where's the damn justice in it? Uh, Bug, got a hitch. Think he's what now? Housekeeping's in my way. You know. Okay, got a distractor. Uh, let's see what's on the subnet. All right, on it. Mean you're a noble Arasaka. Got a smart room panel. Men like him are always single. Hmm. Might no, work expensive not in the least. suits, but he's a biker at heart, always itching for a ride. Terrarian's got a control panel. <laughs> Somehow I doubt guard. it. And wipe him out. Honey, what would you say to a TV? It's a white neck glass, huh? I'd say You're keep looking. You're leaving everywhere. Terrarian's got a temp and air quality controller. Cream, yeah. Sick the flathead on it. Hey, Bug, it worked. <laughs> Ain't seen nothing yet. We got any idea how much those things cost? Keep moving. No time for backpatting. just beyond the door. Flathead can jimmy the lock. Looks like he's having trouble. Shit. Gotta be another way. Let me think. Got another cam other side of the door, but it's disabled. Want me to enable? Yeah. Look around for a CCTV port. at it. Now toggle over to the other camp. Dwellers inside. Just as planned. Still weird, the hotel's only got one runner. Decent dwellers as good as a dozen rank and file. 
Flathead ought to be able to neutralize it. Good thinking. Let me graft a demonoid onto your link. And you know you gotta jack the Flathead directly into his chair, right? Make it sound like I'm new at this. Okay, sent. He's all yours. You'll have to get the Flathead in there first, though. Shaft may link both rooms, looks like. Let's figure it out. Might have found our way in. Send the Flathead over there, then toggle over to the second camp. Flathead into the chair, beat. Jack in. Flathead stays, right? To keep an eye on the dweller, yeah. Punching into Kompeki's main net. You go ahead and log out. Así es como se hace. How you feeling? Fine. A little dizzy, that's all. Bug, how you doing on time? You there, Bug? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. So, listen, ice is thicker than I thought. Piercing it'll take a couple hours. Couple hours? Can't do it any faster. Want my brain to burst into flames? Just sit down and enjoy your snazzy sweet. Thanks. I will. V, uh, you take it easy, okay? Rest up a bit. What do you think? Why'd you give it all up? Who gave what up? Yorinobu Arasaka. The good life, I mean. Old news, I know. Just got to thinking's all. It's like, think. You got everything, right? Eddie's, education. Your pops can snap his fingers and turn half the fucking planet into a nuclear wasteland. But instead, you're like, nah, fuck it. And what do you go do? Start a fucking gang. Steel dragons or some shit. You ghost from your fam, chip some real skin, and play gang leader for a few years. For what? Maybe he just wanted out of the system. So then why'd he come back? Tough to ditch the system when the system's your own family. Black sheep still a sheep, huh? One way to put it. Crawled back on all fours, tail between his legs. Fucking cheap-ass rebel. <laughs> Fucking tourist. Tourist or not, he just walked into the lobby. And we are back in biz. Penthouse security is neutralized. Perfecto. Let's start the show. Hey, Buck. Where, uh... Were you on comms that whole time? Three and a half hours. Uh... How about that stick up the ass? Mean the one of mine? Uh, slip of the tongue, you know? I know. Now's your chance to make up to me. This is going pretty smooth, right? Right? Man, are you the silver lining type. Hey, when are you gonna wave off that dark cloud hanging over your head? I'm telling you, it's downhill from here on in. Silence. You, uh, wanna hear a joke? Now? Seriously? Okay. So why'd the rocker boy's output kick him out of the apartment? Because he wasn't chipping in. Jeez. Not bad being heir to the Arasaka Empire. Sure is shit better than being a son of Raul Wells. Guys, focus. The safe. And make it quick. Why? What's the rush? Sing on your Nobu's gone dark. What is he, a fucking sorcerer? Some kind of dead zone's my guess. Have him back in a sec. And you do your damn job. There, under the floor. Look around for a switch.
Nope. There it is. Bingo. Got something ejected. Come here, Vish. Personal and make us rich. On it. Your turn, bug. Give me two. Oh, that's not I good. Visitors. Bug. Uh, don't know who, but staffs of bugs, all two hundred on their feet, can't keep still. Can't say I like this. How much longer, T? Shit, you're a Nobu's penthouse bound. Fuck him! Open the safe! Almost got it. Done. Cream. Let me look to this, huh? Relic intact? Bio shard integrity, 100%. Guess that that's a yes. Good, let's go. Cover. Where? That pillar, try that. You fucking kidding? No, inside it now. We're in. Which don't solve our problem, T. I fucking know our problem's still there. Let me think for a sec, okay? I thought I don't smash her. Bodyguard. Oh, no. Horse. Night City. ことなんかないだろう。あんたの問題点はそこだ。世界は自分中心に回ってると思ってる。傲慢だよ。よりのど。どうしてここへ。直々に俺に屈辱を合わせる立場を思い知らせるためにか。出る杭は打たれると良く
これまでお前の向こうには目をつぶってきただがそれもここまでだこの裏切りだけは決して許せぬ貴様の母親が生きていなくてよかった息子の不甲斐ない姿を目の当たりにして心を痛めずに済んだのだからな。Just happened in there. Your noble just offed Suburo. What? You know what this means? Security's gonna swarm the place any second. Oh my god, we're so fucked. Bug, need you get us out of here now. Give me a sec. We don't have a sec. Fuck. Okay, got something. Window, now. Releasing the lock. Should see a ladder. Ladder. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 not now. I've been made. <laughs> fuck! b i t c h i d o Santo Bendito. Just lost T. Fuck! Fucking major leaks. Happy now, Jackie? Parker! Call her! 
And tell her we fried the case? Just do it! The... Kapeki's all over the feeds. What the fuck's going on there? Got a problem. Crowd case is damaged. Biochip's integrity at... Jackie? 86%? 86% and drop it. Shit. Okay, listen to me. There's only one thing you can do. One of you's gotta slot the relic into your neural port. That doesn't sound safe. The longer you wait, the greater the risk we'll lose it. Well, someone's gotta do it. In the nombre del Padre. Jackie, you okay? No, no. I guess. Don't feel any different. Once we're back, we'll take out the relic and run a full brain scan and sweep. But you two need to get the fuck out of there first. We're working on it. Hell, we'll be there in a couple. Be ready. Got it? Certainly, Mr. Wells. Better be fucking certain. We gotta somehow reach the lobby. Only chance to hit the garage. Then we best be quick. Now, what I see? Gray. Now let's get out of here. All right. So crazy shit happens in this game. And my mom is sneezing like crazy. Seems as it. Attention. Code red has been initiated Security throughout the Kapeki Plaza. Clear. Please remain in your room. Well, you got time to the room. Given special. by staff. Take a look. Okay. Forces. In the lobby now. We're gonna sweep the building. All floors. Damn it. Oh, I'm kind of used to Avengers right now.
Come out with your hands in the air!
Protect him! Hey! Got a shard of security clearance! Strength, Jackie. What do you think I'm doing? But she'll be. We'll get out alive. Why? Cause you fucking say so? Don't take this out on me. Can see how the chips are falling. <laughs> You gotta be shitting me. Jackie, get in here, buddy. Fuck 
Keep dry! Not bad. Client feedback noted. How's our ride looking? Tip top. Though alas, we are being pursued. Oh, oh shit! Hey Jasmine. Yeah, I'm not. I'll be right back. Okay, okay.
What? The Excelsior package provides for the disposal of passenger remains free of charge. I merely require a destination. Give me a sec, will you? Mr. Wells's remains. Where shall I take them? What are you with his family? Mr. Wells's closest blood relative is Guadalupe Alejandro Wells, proprietress of the El Coyote Coho Bar. I will make sure to huh? deliver him safely. Mr. Tashawn awaits you in room number 204. Bring me some TV first. TV. into this mess let's start with your prep work you had no idea Saburo Arasaka could be at the hotel I don't have access to his personal fucking schedule and besides nobody asked you to kill the old man that wasn't us no shit tell that to the soccer ninjas they send after you Settle down. Gotta be tactical about this. Parker, Eddie, then we leave the city limits behind. But first, your face got blood all over it. Bathroom's there. Go get yourself cleaned up. First combo. Seems I've I'll chosen fucking quite kill you. No place of glory for me. Oh, 
Dhabi. Johnny Silverhand. What the hell are you watching? TikTok. Yeah. 
On the elevator, arm it, let gravity do its thing. Explosion rocks the foundation, tower crumbles, chaos, screaming war crest. Exit window's gonna be Damn, I love this gun. Demolitron. Do you have the multiplayer shit? Shotgun oh. elite income. Run yes. Away. I have the multiplayer. Shoot the cables. Get the rotor spinning. We're on our way. You should play modern warfare. Not done yet. Still need to feed this to the subnet. Is it that modern warfare? It. Oh. This was or never about cold corporate cold. colonialism. This was about They're your groupie output, though. wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door locked, Bruce. You're a sons of bitches incoming. Corporate colonialism. 
Night City's mayor, Imbole Ebunike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. And here I am trying to be a good brother and visit you. They're moving up. Hit the roof quick. Oh, hey, I got 34 points. There's a lot. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Shit. Oh, why did I? No one died. It's Smasher. Adam Smasher. Ugh. Uh, uh, not missing much. Let's try once more. Your associates. Who are they? How did you acquire crystal material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire crystal material? Ugh. died in that tower. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness. とは嘘つき自分自身を欺く。だが、しゃを違う。しゃは雄弁だが、彼らは決して嘘をつかない。死者の言葉には慎ましさがある。始めろ。
And you, who are you? Heavier than he looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So, lest you and me figure this out. Tell me everything. What do you mean you don't have any friends that are girls? Then you never see them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Arasaka, Sama. Otto, Sama, Sasuga, Hansi. Kono, 1 時間後には着くから。ファック、クワイエット。
your eyes open. Fuck. We both could be using medical attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? I know. Someone. We must get the Ripadoc. Quickly! Well back there. Do not waste time. Hector will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. Why? Why not just cut me loose? I'm a dead weight to you. Make the call. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the surface area. Just come pick me up. I need to get to Misty's Isodzerica in front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less okay. than 20 minutes. Okay. What are you doing? Hey! Proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Precious tanking. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of. I know what I'm doing.
be? You in there? Ah! My head. How you feeling? Fuck. I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. But I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. And then I let it all out into a mic. And I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different, strange, and I hated it. Hated everybody, every inch. It was too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Saying I experienced another Psyche's memories? How's that possible? You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. Who? Me and who, Vic? Who's the other? Johnny Silverhand, a terrorist. Real talk of the town back in my day. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. You've never given me that look before, Vic. What is it? You, uh... Don't got a lot of time left, kid. Say what now? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. B, it's important you get all this. It picks me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would be. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing, not one deep. Okay, there was, is, a construct, a psyche on the chip, that of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. People don't just die and get up like nothing happened. Used to be true. Now it's only if they don't have a classified piece of corporate tech primed to resurrect them. What about me? My sight? I'll make it back from the other side and what? I'm supposed to pretend change is normal? Ask the Arasaka engineers who built the thing. All I know is, your mind's gonna go. It won't be pretty. So you just have a crush on From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out. While your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic. 
inevitable, and neither of you can stop it. Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Fuck. I remember this thing. Saw it on TV. What was that stupid slogan? Nope. Soul something? Secure your soul. But that's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe. But this is a prototype the look of things somehow made it out of Arasaka labs Vic you've always come through for me if there's nothing you can do to help me then well what the hell do I do tell me please Vic I wish I knew kid Misty You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Die. And I thought I was gonna die. With him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizine's from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain can be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for? Ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? I gotta lie down. Here. Got one more thing for you. Nope. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? Didn't you hear? My condition's terminal. What good can this do? Don't be silly. As long as you're alive, there's hope. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You really think I can make it? Survive this? Of course you can. I mean, you did already die and come back once, didn't you? Misty, wait. Uh, about Jackie. Yeah? Jack was the best friend I ever had. 
I'm gonna miss him something awful. If he was here, he'd tell you to get your ass out of bed in the morning and do what you need to do. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. Get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? smoke then go out and get some just need one last one jesus fucking christ man the fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be fucking go stop <laughs> who you work for start talking fuck No, wait! Never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like I'm mold on fruit creeping, creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Leave me alone. Get out. Just get the fuck out. Led to the head. Only thing that will fix this. Hear me, asshole. A bullet to the fucking brain.
algebra here. We must meet. Come to Tom's diner. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. When danger lurks, the team will be there. Seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Just trouble, usual stuff. Ah, ah. In need of iron and lead, then, I take it? Sure, let me see what you got. Um, she's just having one of her episodes. Mm, not sure what that means, but okay. What do you mean episodes? She has, she has some episodes. Oh, never mind. Probably don't want to. 
No, you don't. Gabriel are here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so, if you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner. I am waiting. Hey! Hey! Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Ah, the shit! Just trouble. Usual stuff. Ah, ah. You need a iron and lead then, I take it? Sure. Let me see what you got. DJ. Hmm? Still in Cyberpunk? Yeah. Okay. Streaming it, believe it or not. You're what? I said I'm live streaming it on YouTube, believe it or not. Nice. Please tell me they can't. No. You took a whole hot fucking minute to say that shit. <laughs> You're lying to me. <laughs> you fucking cunt. I'm not lying to you. I yes, swear you they can't hear you. What, what's your fucking YouTube? <laughs> it's my first and last name. <laughs> no, it's... Christopher Downsend of the Kentucky Florida Corporate Hotel while attending a family gathering. The CJ is the first of mine and S E and D. It's town sin. Oh, town sin. Alright, there's a good four different things in here with you. How many subscribers do you have? Today, we all mourn the untimely... No, 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 I'm a tech, not a miracle. Just give me... DJ. Hmm? You got 193 subscribers? I used to have less than that with my old channel, but it got removed. That's you with the 57 videos? No. My new channel has a picture of me and my friend. Uh, not I'm in a white jacket.
shit really had me go all the way the fuck down halfway across the world. Hey, if I knew how to leak my channel, I would have sent to you this instant. Jesus Yo ass fuck really got my whole voice coming through that shit. <laughs> hey, on you found me? I most certainly did. You got another follow, you will. <laughs> How did you find me that quickly? I'm looking for There's myself. This thing called filters. Oh. Uh. And I just went through for videos, and then I went down to supply. And voila, it's on joy. Nope, nope, nope. Oh. Oh. Uh, no. Gonna start charging you. I, I, I was Dead. I was talking about the car. Ugh. You do not look so bad. Oh, no, I'm gonna start charging you because you're about to use it. In the car, I doubt what? That you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? You do not have the copyright to my voice. I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. <laughs> this about the biochip. That why I'm here. Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it will be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slide if you speak of. Nah. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Mm. Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorino Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice. In Night, Night City. City, I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? Hey. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. 
You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, it's hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist. Thoroughly. <laughs> Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a Paul. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. <laughs> we need to think about it. We'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help me. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. <laughs> Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Helmut? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Ro. Take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo Sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. Hey guys. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. 
calling some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Helmet, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Oh no. Zapper doubles what and fill. Silverhand. Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're eager. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Chris's past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a oh, talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. As a Don't need convinced. Seen your memories. Gross. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. I heard about the heist, I take it. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Old damn city's heard. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy. You're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's?
Hey, look. Ow! Would you look at that? You see it too, right? You've either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe a... seen you here before got a good memory for faces we're closed right now need to talk to punch and Judy she in her den yep take the stairs down I'll let Judy know you're coming whoa whoa start again what is it you want to do Joy toy, you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I made that clear. Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community, solidarity, classic dilemma. What comes first, family or the outside this world? This is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty worldviews. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Listen, 
Have you seen Evelyn? I need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. You need to find out who she was working for. That's it? That's it. Judy, you don't need to worry. I won't lay a hand on it. It wouldn't make sense. Fine. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Maggot's hour. Luxurious. Wait. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Gotten virtues out of street dealers that were light years crisper. Congrats, no one cares. Apart from Judy, oh, she'd love your feedback. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Away. Kaku Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then.
I'll pass. Oh, what now? Verdes en el sur en Haywood. I'm Sebastián Ibarra, the Colby Padre. V, nice to meet you. I like people who understand the value of respect. We'll be in touch, V. We got to get rid of him. Really? He's pretty massive. V. Nice to see you. Oye, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. Truth. What is happening? At night, when Jackie fell. Let's just say things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. And a friend, uh, what's that exactly? Friends and family. We gather to celebrate the departed, our memories of them. And we bring things they loved in life and might need in the after. Sure, some beer'd be at the top of Jackie's list. <laughs> and there will be beer. I want to take part in the ceremony, but I want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket, that it'd do justice to his memory, I, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry, he's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. Not so long ago, he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. 
Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. I the mail. We're gonna do this, Brenda, and then we're gonna call it here. Ivy. You're here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well... Human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. No, Jack was a little of that too. Always looking on the bright side. He wore his heart on his sleeve. And wasn't at all afraid to live fully. Had his inner demons though. Who doesn't? Exactly. They're what makes us who we really are on the inside. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set. You two didn't get that far? He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. We need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things. Disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. There's his art. It's a fine piece of metal in mechanics. He was so psyched. For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times, always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. You read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say... Barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Gotta be hanging here since 2020. <clears throat> Locked. I wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere. Found it. Once a day. Huh. 
Oh, Jackie. That a mandala? Mm hmm. Oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was... Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, mini. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Jackie's favorite tequila. Huh, still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. Leather belt. Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. True memento, this. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What'd she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. You have got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? You mean in... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane? To Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. P. It's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. I still haven't fixed that. <laughs> hey, Vet. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. 
When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Malmstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. Looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. He was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olo, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh, I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He bought some goods clipped from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. <laughs> A lizard. And, uh, I remember what he said then. That I came from a place where everyone's family so he must be too. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. Kept Haywood in his heart, always. He made him who he was. But most importantly, everyone saw Jackie as a grinning charmer who saw the good in everyone. Everything. But they were wrong. Jackie Wells was a hell of an ambitious chum who never gave up. And his drive cost him his life. But he did in life what he said he'd do. Reach for fortune and fame. No fear in eyes or heart. He feared no one. He wasn't afraid. He lived life to the fullest. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Por mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful friend that we gave him. Yeah. 
owe you another for Jaquito. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar in his favorite spot where he always used to sit. Poor for Jackie. Amen, brother. Campos all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one of his own. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you die. Chingado. Don't go start at something, eh? Not today. I'm gonna miss him. I already do. <laughs> Me too, Capron. Me too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right. Why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. Go for now, thanks. See? Gotta know when to stop. Aye, right, give me a break. All right, let's go. Hey. You all right? Yeah. I think I'm just still in that garage, mentally. I just need a sec. Ah. A lot of people come today. Even that poor Dika Jackie was messing around. to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the beating happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. Jackie, uh, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took him into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Misty, and she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go, invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuida te vi. Alright. Now, banding on the first stream was, uh, 
was horrible, but this one... This one was emotional for me. Every every words that V said about Jackie is true. He put his friends before himself. Put his family before himself. And he lived life to the fullest. That's easy to him. Alright, well. I'm gonna be heading out now, so I will see y'all in the next stream. So, I'll see y'all later.